large rope sting on an open fire. Good morning, Vlogmas Day 7. Um, this morning's breakfast was inspired by Teresa's Einstein Bagel breakfast at her school. My mom works at the hospital and she gets like a lot of vendors who come in and bring free food and she'll like bring home all the leftovers and give it to us. And so Panera came through the other day um, with their bagels. Take a look at this shoes. This is like way more whole than bagel. Like that's an atrocity right there. Morning Mella gang. Shadow and I are on our way to work. It's a brisk 38 degrees over here where I'm at. And I know it's not like Colorado, but it's cold enough to where my car literally warned me, be careful, there might be ice on the road. Um, she's not used to that, so she's just not ready. Good morning, Mella gang. Another day, another coffee. Shout out to Lisa for getting me this mug for Christmas one year. Um, I use it pretty often, it's really good. And gotta use my oat milk, of course. Today, before school, I'm making udon. Um, it's a really fast recipe I use with the Trader Joe's Tempura Shrimp. Um, first, I'm making the sauce, just boiling some water, putting the tempura shrimp in the air fryer, and then boiling some water for the udon noodles. For the sauce, you'll need a third tablespoon of dashi, a tablespoon of soy sauce, and a tablespoon of mirin. And the udon only needs to boil for one minute. It's really fast and you get these really nice chewy fat noodles. Um, after straining them, I pour in the sauce. And by this time, the tempura shrimp's done, so I add my little doraemon furikake, shichimi togarashi, which is like this chili pepper. And then you plate it and then you're done. It takes me less than 10 minutes to make and it's really good. It's a super easy meal. And then after that, I'm ready and off to school. What's up, y'all? <clears throat> I'm on my lunch break right now. Work from home vibes. Um, literally just brushed my teeth. Benefits of working from home. But um, so basically, uh, relaxing at yeah. um, Michelle's and Tina's parents, they got us burritos. Um, but we don't have like Mexican salsa at home. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna go to Cotijan's. I'm gonna just go inside, I'm gonna pump out some hot sauces, come back, enjoy my burrito. That's how, that's how, that's how much sauce means to me. Like sauce makes everything good when it comes to burrito. Like I love burritos so much, but you just, you gotta have like burritos with sauce. You can't have one without the other. Here's your life hack for today, y'all. If you have a burrito and no sauce, that's what you go ahead and do. All right, so we've been having a little bit of a dilemma with USPS in this area because one of our um, baby shower gifts was stolen right from our front door. Actually, that wasn't USPS's fault. That was FedEx or whoever stole it their fault but um i do got beef with usps over here because one time i got a key a parcel locker key in my mailbox and when i opened the parcel box the order wasn't even for me so i'm like what if one of my packages what if what if the key for one of my packages ended up in somebody else's locker you know and then another time I got a package at my door and there was a note on it saying, oh, sorry, this was dropped off at my door. I accidentally opened it without looking. Um, it's actually yours. So this USPS person is not delivering things correctly. And then the other day, my next door neighbor dropped off a package at my door and she said that it was the box was just left like on top of all the mailboxes. So like anyone could have grabbed it basically. So this morning, when I saw the USPS person drive away, I was like, I better come down there and snatch up whatever uh, he or she left that's mine in case somebody gets to it first. And matter of fact, I did get a package. Um, I don't recognize what this is from, but 
I have a feeling it might be my breast pump that my insurance sent me. Let's take a look. In fact, it is. Take a look at her. Uh, leave a comment down below if you'd like me to show a tutorial on how to use it. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, it's gonna be an interesting journey, um, lactation journey. Shadows for a shuttle ride. Are you gonna get a piece of bacon? No. Oh, bacon! Sit. High five. High five. Good <laughs> <Hey> boy. <laughs> Thank you. What's up, Melly Gang? Um, I am working and also editing the vlog on my lunch right now. Today is my day to be able to edit the vlog. Um, I don't know if anyone has done this before, but I wanted to show the behind the scenes of what it looks like to be able to, to, to edit a vlog full of six people. So this is what it looks like so far. I'm just uh, editing. We got to put in, there's all these things that we have to do, like with the intro, we got our um, name tags as well that we got to insert in. Uh, but pretty much what I do is I like look through everyone's clips. Um, we also break it up too. So we edit our own clips and then we have one universal person who edits. And the way that we communicate is by putting pictures in between, uh, in between the clips that we want to cut out like for different times. So sometimes they're really funny. Like <laughs> Tina put this as her, as her picture still. Like this one's Lisa's right here. We got Justin Herbert. And then we have uh, Joseph right here as well. <laughs> They're just funny. But yeah, so I'll be editing this right now. It doesn't take too long. I need to put in my clips um, and then the rest of some other people as well. And then we have exactly what you're working on. So it's like, I don't know, vlog section right here. Today's maternity OOTD is sponsored by Old Navy. I got these jeans for like, I think like nine bucks or something. She got like a little waistband to support the belly. We got the chugs. That's my regular non-maternity sweater. And I'm wearing this coat again because um, it's not every day you could wear this in San Diego. So I'm just trying to like get the most wear out of it during winter. Shadow, do you have your own desk? What are you doing? What are you putting your head in my arm? So cute. I did this bandana, huh? <laughs> Go get him. What's up, Mella Gang? It's 7.30 p.m. right now. Um, I'm going home from school. I just wanted to show you um, the botanical garden by my apartment. It has lights, it's super cute. Okay, you can like barely see it from here, but like when I was driving by, it was a whole thing. And I, like I'd never seen this before, so I think they just lit it up tonight. Terrible quality, but like maybe I'll see it tomorrow um, when I'm driving home. What's up, y'all? So I just took another nap. Woke up very late, had to rush to the gym again. It's a common theme that's happening right now. I'm trying to get on back on my BS though and you know not do that. Um, but you know, I thought since I didn't do much today except for gym and work, I'd do a little, you know, work from home home tour. So this is my chair right here. I had this, I built this last year because um I used to only work on my my bed or I would work um <coughs> at the office at my old job. But because I started working from home more often and I had a shitty chair, I was like, okay, I need to get a chair. So I got it, it's like a gamer chair, it's pretty nice. I always have to use the, uh, the recliner though because my, I have patellar tendonitis and I've had it for like almost a year now. So I can't really like have my legs just like bent. I always have to have them stretched out. So I always use the recliner. I used to use this massage thing. I feel like I should use it more often because I have back problems. Um, but I haven't used it recently. And then I have my monitor, my McDonald's headset and then my work laptop. And then I also have uh, 
these guys that Lisa got me. Um, and then uh, I might just J Herbo of uh, Uncle Pop. Later, I drove to Jed um, to visit him because I had a free day. Uh, and then I ended up helping them put up their Christmas tree. I actually put up all the ornaments for this tree. No cap, I did everything. Um, and I'm actually really proud of how it turned out. This is like the best tree I've ever done. So I kind of want to drop out of school and do trees by tea tricks. I've been wandering around in Kohl's. If you didn't know, here is a little hack. Um, when you buy stuff on Amazon and you need to return it, you can return it at a Kohl's and they give you um, a $5 coupon. So here's what I found. So I found these little mini stockings for $3. And then this is 60% uh, off right now. And online there's another 20% off coupon. So all right so i have finished dinner i am done with work and everything um i don't know really know what to do so i'm just cleaning up my christmas wish list um tell me why though everything on my list is so expensive so far <laughs> yeah nobody's getting this except me what's up Melly gang i literally got home ate dinner and like hung out with my roommates and did nothing but now i gotta write a whole research paper I have to shower, but here's the fit check. Got the puffy vest, the sushi playboy pants, and we got the Air, Air Maxes. It was only like 45 degrees today, but I stay inside all day at school, so. Oh, swear on my the moon, oh wow. Every time I take Shadow to work, he gets really overstimulated, and so he gets really tired when he gets home. Oh. Hey Shadow, did you just wake up from a nap? Oh. Why is Shadow literally me when I'm wearing a robe? Okay, so I made some additions to the house with the things I got today. Take a look. 